Hello guys, we are a cool couple and today we want to talk about how we met. Mm, exactly. <laughs> we should have made this video a long time ago, but for many different reasons we couldn't really do it. Mm. But this is a video you guys ask about a lot. You always curious how we met. When I meet people, uh, people actually get surprised I met a foreigner. And then when I tell them like I'm, my wife is from Colombia and they are really shocked. <laughs> that, why so not many people, not many Colombians actually mm. living in Korea. That's why. Uh, yeah. So they don't probably know Colombia much. Mm. So today we are going to finally talk about it. Mm. So we met um, in Boston mm. while we both were um, studying abroad. So you, why you were there? Initially, I went to Boston to study English, but and then I wanted to study longer, so I got transferred to one of the universities in Boston. Mm -hmm. And yeah, that's, that's why I went to Boston. Mm -hmm. I got away as a lawyer in Colombia, and then I worked for a little while, but then I thought I really want to experience living abroad mm -hmm. and learning English, so that's why I went to Boston. And my plan was just staying there for six months, and come back to Colombia to keep working and yeah that's how we yeah. end up in the same place at the same moment exactly <laughs> it was like uh, 2012 yes 2012, 2012. Uh, that was my last semester mm. and I had to get a job or I had to come back to Korea so I was working on you know applying jobs and you know also studying so I was really busy mm. But well, somehow my roommates they they wanted to have a Halloween party. Yeah. So when I went to school and I made friends with some of the people from my school, one of my classmates invited me to this Halloween party, mm. and that's how we ended up in the same place. Same place, right? Right. Mm. But it was really lucky because I think if we don't meet in that moment, we don't meet at all. Yeah. Because what a chance! What a coincidence! Yeah. Because right? then he has to come back to Korea really soon, and I just. Right. went to Boston so no really many chances to meet mm, besides sure. that, that moment right so the short answer is we met in a Halloween party mm. so how was your impression when I met you when you met me actually I'm not a huge fan of a Halloween party and mm. my friends but they are really all like uh, excited and they're really outgoing so Anyway, I follow. I follow the. You follow they... because it was your house. Otherwise, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Otherwise you don't go. anyway, they are really nice people, and they invite all the friends. Mm. And she showed up with, with one of my friends, and yeah, she looks cute. I was worrying about. But Sorry, she I... had a lot of thick makeup because oh, she was like cat my, woman. I was a cat woman. So... I was a cat woman, and my friend had a little bit too much fun with the makeup on me because it was my hmm. first Halloween in America so I remember when we met he was like no, scared I, of me I mean I wasn't like that but anyway <laughs> a, a lot of thing makeup so I didn't really know how you look like without mm -hmm. makeup so I couldn't really I couldn't really judge he was really shy he was I really mean, really shy still he is really shy really? but <laughs> yes you are so we end up make we end up like a what is it? carving carving, carving the pumpkins yeah, we end up carving the pumpkins together because mm. we are with another friend, but he let us alone, so we have to kind of talk. Yeah. And I feel like, I think that was like, I think it was love at the first sight for me. I don't know. I don't know well, when I saw him, I really like him because he looked so shy and sweet and decent. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how we met. But then, how we start hanging out? But then, I don't know, after. Probably two weeks, she posted oh, something become, on Facebook. We like, become Facebook friends. Mm. That was the first thing. And then she posted something like, "Oh, it's snowing, and I never seen snowing." So I think my first snow. Yeah. Something like that. So I was like, "How come she never, never seen <laughs> snowing in her in I mean, entire I saw life?" Snow in the mountain in Colombia, but never really in the city. That's that's yeah. I was really I love it. I thought it was so so pretty. <laughs> Anyway, I thought that's kind of cute and interesting. So I texted her. Like, 
really? Is that really first first mm. time you saw the snow? Mm. We start texting and then I ask ask her like, oh, let's hang out. Yes. I think I ask her if you want to watch a movie, mm. right? Yeah. Well, I want to tell you something. So I, I asked her to watch a movie. I was waiting in front of a movie theater and then she came out from the subway station. And I saw her and she was really pretty. <laughs> I mean, she, she... I was? I mean, she, she... You are, you are. But anyway, when I saw her for the first time, she was a lot of makeup. So I didn't really know. I couldn't really judge. But anyway, second time I met her in front of a movie theater. Oh, oh really? She, she <laughs> was really pretty. Oh. She, she was wearing the jeans and the, the boots. <laughs> I was, you know, because I remember. Hmm? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the, the second time I met her, I was oh. So love, the you know, first sight, love for the second sight. Something like that. <laughs> mm. that's okay, that's, that's, that, that's, that's cute. So we met to, to go to see some movie, but we couldn't really find anything we like. So we decided to grab a coffee. Right, right. Mm. But then what happened <laughs> in the coffee shop? A little bit embarrassing, <laughs> oh. I have to tell you. <laughs> I mean, in America, if you order a cup of coffee, then they ask your name. So they write your name on the cup. But I don't know, somehow I couldn't remember her name. <laughs> so I call her some other's name. Like you couldn't remember my name? That's so horrible. I know, but I don't know. Somehow I, I couldn't remember I her name, so I said you. something else. Oh. Some... But why you say this girl's name? Because I met her on the way to uh. see you. So... Yeah, so it was really embarrassing. Like the girl mm. from the coffee shop, she was looking at me like, yeah, she oh was my god. looking at me really bad. Like, and yeah. I was like, he started sweating yeah, so really... much. So I was feeling like, I just laugh, laugh it up. And, it's okay, don't worry. Like yeah, I'm not really play or anything, just I <laughs> couldn't remember the name. Oh, yeah, I don't know how I did you after that. I mean, yeah. I mean, really embarrassing, but anyway, <laughs> I didn't really mean to. But after that, we grabbed coffee. And, and we then walk around. We walk around, we went to Boston Common Park. That's really pretty. Mm, it was really mm. pretty. And then our first day, he took me to this really pretty and fancy Italian restaurant and it was so romantic, it was so nice but <laughs> when we want to have some wine he started getting nervous again and sweating again because he realized he left his passport I mean, after after I show her like how I feel about her I, I wanted to do something nice something romantic, romantic together so I research I found a really nice restaurant and I invite her yeah of course being romantic I wanted to have a glass of wine with her but he left his passport but so we ended up having always, just water as always <laughs> I, I did something I Some, made a mistake yeah I, I was just laughing out like that's not that's not new <laughs> yeah that was really bit embarrassing I thought um you were really thoughtful and it was you know, like, he tried hard, so I, I like it, it was a nice... <laughs> <laughs> I, I was really trying, yeah, I, I know. was really, I know really trying. trying so hard. That's what I remember. So basically, we keep meeting a lot, hanging out, and he was showing me the city, and teaching me English, and we got really close, but at some point, he started telling me, like, um... Yeah, one day, we were in the pub, right? And then we were drinking beer and I don't know. I told her if I knew if I met her earlier, mm -hmm. it would be great because mm -hmm. I might have to go back to Korea if I didn't get a job. Yeah. So he... I kind of show how I feel about her. Yeah. And at that point, at that moment, I figure I also like you. So mm -hmm. let's just be together for now, right? Like... Yeah, something like that. Yeah. So we we knew. I might have to go back, but anyway, we just start, start spending time together yeah, as much as possible. Together. Exactly. And it was really nice. It was really nice time. We made friends. We got closer. We even have a ski trip. Yeah, ski trip. We went ski trip. Uh, to what is that? New Hampshire. To New Hampshire. New Hampshire. Yeah. So it was so beautiful, like the snow and the house, and really found friends. 
Mm. We have a really great time. So that trip was fun and it was, I think, good for us to start like to see how we get along and how we mm. get with other when other people is around. That's and fun. it was so beautiful, like really romantic, right? That was our mm. first Christmas. Yes, our first Christmas together. Mm. Yeah, our yeah. first Christmas. Mm. So then we also spent New Year's Eve together. Mm. And then what happened? Oh, you got right. crazy. I was applying all different companies in the United States and in Korea and I got a job interview probably like in a week mm -hmm. but in the com Korea. yeah companies from Korea mm. so I had to decide if if I want to go back to Korea or, or just stay to find a job in the United States but I was really stressed out getting a job and all that so I don't know why I did it but <laughs> I was crazy but anyway <sighs> I decided to go back. I decided to go Korea. So he planned the trip like in two two days. That's crazy. Anyway, I was I was really worried. I I guess. Yeah, he was too stressed out about getting a job, and then he suddenly left the country, and he didn't even say goodbye to many of his friends. Yeah, I couldn't really say goodbye that's, to that's all crazy. my friends. That's Just a couple of, couple of them. After living like three years in America in mm. Massachusetts, he just go. You remember I flew back for the one interview and actually I, I had an interview and then I didn't get it. <laughs> I couldn't get it. So I was like, what the, what the hell? Of course, bad I, I flew back for nothing. Mm -hmm. oh, I really hate the <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but that's your interview. I mean, I, I know, I know. But I I felt like I, I could, I was going to meet you again. I didn't feel like we are breaking up or anything. We decide so, to have long distance relationship. And I told um, her we can meet up. We can meet we up can in meet June, summer. 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 That was what we planned. It was beginning mm. of winter mm. and we planned to meet summer. Mm. So we stay apart for mm. like seven months. Seven months. Really busy. I was studying two schools. So I was super busy. And you also. Yeah. I think the reason we, we could overcome the long distance relationship was we were both busy. Mm -hmm. I mean, we talk every day. Every day. Every day that's the really most important mm -hmm. thing. So he was busy trying to find a job. Mm -hmm. So, but well, we talk every day. Mm -hmm. And then finally, summer. Summer. Summer came. But at that point, I wasn't sure if I want to come to Korea. Because yeah, she was getting checking out. <laughs> because I got a job in my school, mm. and because of my job, I got social security number, and mm. I started getting like, I, I don't know, things were getting good. You mm. know, were getting better in America for me in Boston, and I love the city. I have really good experience. I met nice people. Like, I was like, I don't know if I should leave because then I will lose my student my student visa. So I didn't know what to do. But somehow, I mean, I knew he was worth it, of course, and he was really <laughs> nice and decent guy. <laughs> so uh. yeah, I I decided to come to visit for one month, right? It was just yeah, very... it was just one month round trip ticket. Yeah. You got round trip ticket, yeah. so you're supposed to go back. Go back to Colombia and see how it goes. Yeah, mm. so I came for one month, and, and then. then... Things getting really, really, really that complicated. That K drama. <laughs> so our K drama is starting. It's starting story. from that point. So, uh, okay. I hope we explain enough. 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 How we met. We're gonna talk about how things getting really complicated. How we start how, our life. How our life in Korea. In Korea, yeah. but a lot of challenges. Mm. Seven years ago when, when I came. It wasn't. It wasn't really easy. I mean. Yeah. I mean, I just literally came to Korea because of you. Exactly. So I wasn't. And yeah, it was. Language, food, culture. Job. Job. So yeah. things getting really complicated and dramatic. So we're gonna talk about it next episode. Next time. Mm. Next episode. So we talk about it next mm. time. My Japanese friends always. Talk about our stories like a K drama, so we will talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> our K drama. 
Yeah. So, um, thank you for watching. Hope you like this video. Please hit the like button and subscribe if you have it. And let us know in the comments what do you think. And, 감사합니다. 감사합니다. <laughs> okay. Ciao. Bye.